Hey everyone, it's JoJo, and today I'll be unpacking Beyblade Burst Chosey Random Layer Collection Volume 10 featuring Orb Aegis as the new rare layer in this collection. So huge shout out to the Divine Portal. Um, I bought them, I bought this from them on eBay. They have a great store, uh, pretty good with shipping. They get things a little bit later than Japan because they're shipping from Taiwan, but still they're very reliable. And uh, just a huge shout out to them. They're they're very good with communication, letting you know where your stuff's at, um, especially when, you know, there's um, there was a recent typhoon in Japan, so there was a little bit of a delay with getting my stuff. But uh, um, overall, they're a really great store, and if you want to check them out, got some QR codes you guys could scan. They got an Instagram and a YouTube channel. I'll also post a link to their store in the description below. All right, so let's just get to it. Um, one of the cool things I love about the Divine Portal is that they have really, really awesome packaging. Everything is very neat and, you know, they take great care in shipping all your stuff. Alright, so, one, two, three, ooh, nice. Four, there's Orb Aegis, and five. So, we got five layers, and let's just take them all out. So we got Ark Bahamut. Nice red recolor. That's really, really cool. Man, it's like a, it's like bloody red. That's really, really vibrant. Heard the stickers that come with it. I'll put them on later. But for now, let's just open all these up. So next up, Emperor Fornius. And we got like a translucent yellow as a recolor, kind of plain, but eh. We got green and yellow stickers, so it's not really gonna show very well on that, I don't think. All right, so next up we have Dragoon Phantom, which I don't even have. <laughs> yeah, very similar to Dragoon Storm, but just slightly different. You know, same overall shape. Oh, but it's got the, uh... The clear plastic teeth. And I think clear plastic teeth are a little bit weaker. There are the stickers. That's gonna look great all together. And next we have... Alter Kronos. Another color. That looks pretty cool. I love the black. And the gold. If only the stickers were, like, gold or yellow, at least. That would look really, really nice. And lastly, but not least, <laughs> Orb Aegis. And supposedly this is like a, a really good layer and a, probably the closest contender to like um, Archer Hercules maybe. Yeah, so is this a, I think that's a defense type? It would make sense for it to be a defense type. Yeah. Yeah, just look at it. It looks like Drasil. Like the overall shape, very tanky looking. And he's got these balls for, that's where he gets his name, Orb. So there's two metal ones on the top and bottom. These ones are plastic, but still it's got metal all around there. It was really nice. And I love the, the motif. It's like a Medusa head or something. <laughs> but yeah, it looks really cool. And it's nice and solid on the bottom. And don't remember... How the teeth are but they look pretty decent and here are the stickers so let's get them all stickered up all right so here are all the layers with the stickers on let's start off with Emperor Fornius pretty bland in my opinion uh, it's okay and we have Alter Kronos and again I really wish these stickers were gold instead of silver but it's kind of like the complete reverse of the original recolor, just noticed, um, like the, the outside would be gray and the inside would be black, but again, yeah, it's, it's just reversed. And then we have Arc Bahamut, really awesome red plastic. Stickers give it a little bit more detail. And then finally we have, not actually, no, not finally, uh, we have Dragoon. And this is my first uh, Dragoon Phantom. I didn't get the original one. And yeah, but yeah, I'm glad that I actually have the layer now so that it could be part of my plastics 
uh, burst collection. And finally, we have Orb Aegis. Stickers didn't really do much, but uh, yeah, it still looks pretty much the same even with or without the stickers. So, in the comment section below, I'd like to know um, a good combo for Orb Aegis. I've been looking at some combo testing on the WBO, and uh, it seems to be doing okay against um, Archer Hercules, but the thing is I don't have a second Eternal, so I can't do like a mirror match or anything like that. Um, I kind of think that it would be really good on Orbit. Um, not so much on Atomic because Atomic has a tendency to like KO itself if you um, launch it at full power, so I think Orbit would help it. Maybe even Bearing if the teeth are okay enough, but uh, I'll, I'm gonna have to do some testing. But also, again, let me know a combo for Orb Aegis in the comment section below. Alright, so uh, thanks for watching. Um, another huge shout out to the Divine Porto Portal. Go check out all their social media and their eBay store. Uh, they're really good. Uh, they're a really good store. They're very, again, they're really good at communicating and all that stuff. Um, again, yeah, thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys soon with more Beyblade Burst.